If you are anything like me, this summer period, sometimes you just feel like bored or you want to do something but you don't know what to do. I got you covered. Today I want to share with you 13 activities slash things you can do when you feel this way. So the first thing I recommend you guys to do is to pray. I mean, prayer is not something you should do only when you feel bored, but you know, it's always good to communicate with God because he is our father and he always wants to hear from us. So in every moment you don't have anything to do, just communicate with the all powerful and almighty God of this universe. Boom. The second thing you can do is worship. Worship is something that is part of us. We are made to worship. There are a lot of songs that speak about the goodness and greatness of God. So just put one of them and just worship. The third thing you can do is to read a book. Reading is so good because it improves our brain's connectivity. It increases our comprehension and our vocabulary. Let me actually show you the books I have. Let's go. Hello everyone. So yeah, these are some of the books I have, like they are not mine, they are of my sister's. And the books I think you all should read um, is, first of all, this one called Redefined. It's more for youth and teenagers of my generation because we've been labeled with some negative words like lazy, broken, lost, and other negative things. But we don't need to focus on these words they have been given to us, but the ones that God originally gave us. Then we have Killing the Kryptonite by John Beer. If you ever watched Superman, you know that Superman had something called Kryptonite that limited his power and made him weak. Just as Christians, we have something that makes us weak. It limits our power. So in this book, he's trying to find our Kryptonite and how to defeat it. Number four, listen to a podcast or a sermon because they let you learn a lot about Christianity and they help you a lot with your work with God. So the sermons or the people I like to listen to are uh, Pastor David Diganandes, Pastor Savchuk, Apostle Selman, and also the ones of my dad that he uploads on Facebook. And the podcast I like to listen to are the ones of John Beer and the ones of Darasimi Mike Bamiloye on Spotify, Google Podcasts, every streaming platform. Number five, watch a movie. A Christian movie and the ones I like to watch are from Mount Zion Ministries in Nigeria on Damila Mike Bamiloye's YouTube channel and one movie you really need to watch is called Abattoir. Number six, watch a video, a Christian video. You know there are a lot of Christian content creators out there but you know we still need a lot of Christian content creators and this leads me to the seventh point which is to open a YouTube channel slash film a youtube video slash film a reel for your instagram page and etc but when you do these things keep in mind that yes you are doing it for the people but you are also doing it for god for the glory of god and to enlarge his kingdom number eight bible study in the bible there are a lot of things you can learn and apply to your daily life so just you know uh, choose uh, a topic to learn and then with the help of uh, you know internet bible commentaries you'll be able to learn a lot from the bible number nine if your church is open go to church and worship god to be in his presence to experience his power in your life and your life will never be the same number 10 learn a bible verse or you know something from the bible that can be a psalm or something that you haven't learned yet you know and to make it more interesting you can also learn it in another language no biara wajini dienu anyera na waye wanya dan kwa so number 12 you can do exercise you can clean you can organize your room but while you are doing this you're listening to christian music so your heart is you know following the music but physically you are doing all these activities the last point is to dance like david did you can just put some music if you're an african you can put some praises music and you would just dance to glorify the name of the lord So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I pray you have been blessed by this video. Don't forget to like, give it, leave a comment, subscribe, and share because it's very important. I will see you next week with another bank of a video. Stay blessed. Ciao, ciao.